I'm going to Ireland. We got the Irish chick. I leave to the airport in like 10 minutes, so let's go get our things. Little room tour. I'll miss you. I'm an exchange student living here in Madrid, but we are going to Ireland for the weekend because it's March, St. Patrick's Day is going up. This has been my dream trip for, I don't even know how long, but I'm finally going. Because we are flying Ryanair. <laughs> oh, Ryanair. We are going to layer a lot because I am not paying for a checked bag. Layer number one. Layer number two. Layer number three. It's getting crowded in here. This is the first time that I leave my apartment since I've been here. I've been here for a month. That's terrifying. Also, I forgot to mention that this is my first flight alone. Fifth and final layer. Was this my fifth or my fourth? I don't know. Oof, that's a lot. What am I getting myself into? Fly Ryanair and look like this. This is the bag that I will be taking on the flight. I look like a turtle. Now that I have everything, let's go to the airport. I have arrived to the airport. Now I just have to find how in the world to get to the terminal. This shall be interesting. The way I got here, and there was absolutely no line, and I got my boarding pass immediately. Right now, you're getting on my good side. I knew that it was too good to be true. My flight got delayed an hour. So instead of arriving there at 9.30, I will be arriving at 10.30 p.m. Thanks, Ryanair. Also, I forgot to mention, not doing a solo trip. I'm only flying there alone. I'm meeting up with a bunch of friends that I have in Ireland right now. It's going to be super, super fun. The sucky part is definitely getting there alone, though. Just got off the plane. It is freezing and it's raining. I made it! Chat, is this real? It's so cute! That's crazy. My first meal, and you guessed it, fish and yeah. chips. Yeah. I'm here with Alexa and Sophia. Hi! <laughs> So we just finished pub hopping and I currently have my boot bag on from the airport because we are exploring. I don't know what I was expecting for hostels but it wasn't this. So I just made it inside the hostel and it's really nice. It was just very complicated getting a room and it's 1 a.m. and I have to wake up at 6. I'm really excited, but I'm running on four hours of sleep. It's a part of the experience. It's cold. Uh, we're gonna have so much fun today. I'm running to my. Guys, we have arrived! Clips, clips, no rain, no rain, no rain. No rain, no rain, no. What? This isn't real. That is the most beautiful thing I have ever seen in my life. Tipos and clips of war. If you guys may or may not know, I'm 1% Irish, so this is my land. Irish Jake at the Cliff of Moore 2024. <laughs> oh. 
Oh my god! Mr. Seagull. Hey. We're in Galway. Woo! Dobro's Pizza. A must. I got a pizza called the Stinger, and it looks pretty spicy, so I'm not, I'm not excited for that. But we're trying new things. We're getting out of our comfort zone. at a chocolate shop here in Galway and I have gotten we get the hot chocolate we got the hot chocolate and I got five different chocolates to try I'm a big chocolate girl so I know that I'm gonna like these the bus departs in two minutes <laughs> we're five minutes away We have bought some goodies at Galway that we are going to wear tonight. Since it's March and St. Patrick's Day is in two weeks, we decided that we're going to celebrate here. Each and every single one of us bought one of these and one of these bad boys. Happy we're ready. Early St. Patty's Day. <laughs> Happy early St. Patty's. When is this going to be posted? On St. Patrick's Day. Not now. Let's go. Yeah, we'll pretend we're like we're in Dublin. <laughs> <laughs> we're like, oh my god, we're in Dublin part two. <laughs> On a taxi because we are freezing. We couldn't walk home. <laughs> we are heading back to the hostel to get some sleep because I'm running on four hours. And your first official day in Ireland is done. I have arrived at the hostel and now I'm going to get ready for bed and see what tomorrow brings. Good morning from St. Patrick's Cathedral. We are heading towards the market right now because they have like a cutesy little market up front. So we're just going to chill at the park and then go to mass at 12 p.m. somewhere else. We just got out of mass. It was very, very much needed. This is a really pretty part of Dublin. We haven't seen this part at all. So I heard that there was a celebrity sighting in Dublin. I think it was Olivia Rodrigo. <laughs> am I walking next? To, am I walking next to Olivia right now? Whoa! 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 I got a blank space, baby, and I'll write your name. Lunch is popping. We're here at Queen of Tarts and we are trying the Guinness cake. Mm. Okay, we 
Yes, it's cute. I like that one. Oh. This is the church cafe that we have found our way to and it has Irish dancing. The vibe is super super nice. This is the crispy chicken burger. <laughs> This is so good! We couldn't finish. <laughs> I have a whole stack of fries and I can't even eat it. It was a lot. Finally checking out of the hostel. Let's go check out. My checkout time is at 11 a.m. But I have to leave to the airport at 6. So I have to rent a locker to put my big bag in because I'm not carrying that around for hours. I'm sorry. This is my first time being in a city alone that I don't live in. Both Alexa and Sophia already left. Sad. I'm going to take myself on a solo date around the city because I need it and it's very well deserved. I think that it's so important to spend time alone. This is definitely a new thing that you have to experience at least once in your lifetime. God said that my time was at 20 years old. <laughs> also, everything is so expensive in Ireland. I swear, you best know I'm having McDonald's for breakfast and for lunch today. When in Ireland, you have to get the shamrock shake. Let's try. Hold up. Why does that taste like toothpaste? Anyway, I'm still gonna drink it because it's good. I decided that I wanted to go to daily mass today since I have so much time. Okay, I found a church and I'm going to go to mass now and I'll talk to you guys after. So pretty. It's raining right now. And I left my umbrella in the hostel, of course. Mass was absolutely beautiful. That was the most beautiful thing I think I've ever done here. I needed to spend time with Jesus today, so. I have secured the souvenirs. I bought a shirt and I bought socks and I got it for five euros. Also, I'm gonna make an Irish playlist cause like, this is a banger. I look ridiculous. The umbrellas here are so expensive, so I bought a plastic bag for five euros. That's a Trinity card. I actually cannot. Everyone at Trinity College can't resist me right now. I just look that good. I'm not gonna lie, I'm fighting for my life right now. Out of all the days, this is the coldest. It's raining, it's windy, my hands. And on top of forgetting my umbrella at the hostel, I also forgot my gloves. This is the Dublin Castle. I don't think I'm going to go in because I actually cannot spend any more money. It's good to see it, why not? The things that happened to me. My bag just broke, like it fell on the floor and all my souvenirs dropped on the ground. I'm glad that I got this bag because if I didn't, things would have been really bad. So now I'm heading to the Temple Bar. Just check it out because I haven't seen it. And then I am walking back. Cannot be here anymore. I'm gaslighting myself into thinking that I'm not cold so I can survive. I have finally arrived at my hostel. 
Oh my god, my bag. A couple minutes I have to walk to where I have to take my shuttle. See you guys at the airport. Oh, how I missed you, Umbrella. Finally boarding. I have been waiting for this moment for too long. Madrid, I'm coming for you. I miss you so much. Last time being in this cold weather. I'm here. I didn't even get to vlog, but I ran off that plane, speed walking to the metro so I can get home. Closes at 1.30. And it's getting close to being 1 a.m. I'm back! I'm back home! Back home, I'm back home. It feels so good to be in mi casita. I miss you so much. That was the end of my Ireland vlog. I really hope that you guys enjoyed it. I know that I enjoyed editing and filming it. There will be more vlogs coming soon because I do have trips planned. So stay tuned for that. This was a super, super fun trip. I'm so grateful for every single opportunity that I've had. I'm very thankful and blessed that I was able to do a trip like this. Thank you so much for watching and see you guys for the next one. Bye. Bye.